Hello. We continue to sew the insulated snowsuit. Today we will start working with line. Cut out two parts of the front of the pants from the lining silk. Two piece back pants. Two sleeves. Cut out a detail of the back of the lining from the fleece with a fold. Two piece front lining. Two side pieces in one central part of the hood. And one collar piece. From adhesive duplicating material, cut into strips one inch wide. Duplicate seam allowances for parts made of lining silk. Duplicate one detail of the front of the hood with the same material. Sew hood details. Make cuts. Turn out the front of the hood and tops. Making marks. These marks must be aligned with the seams of the hood. The front of the hood should be between the shell and the lining. Make cuts. Sew the bottom seam of the hood. I left a hole in the seam of the lining. And now I turn the hood through it.
Now you need to top stitch the bottom of the hood and sew the hole with an invisible seam. Now set the buttons, one in the center, one opposite each seam, and one at the edge, seven buttons in total. Find the center of the collar and the center of the hood, here will be the first button. Fasten the first button and use the booth to mark the places for the second and third buttons next to the seams of the central part of the hood. Fasten the second and third buttons and also determine the place for the fourth and fifth buttons. In the same way determine the place for the 6th and 7th buttons. Instead of buttons, you can sew velcro or just sew the hood to the collar. Sew the collar detail to the front details, but not completely, as we did earlier. Fold collar details face to face and Sew the lining to the zipper. Make cuts on the zipper before and after the seam. Do the same with the other half of the zip. Mm -hmm. 
make a loop. Sew a loop to the lining of the back. From the sides of the back lining we retreat 8 or 10 centimeters, making labels. Focusing on these marks, and on the loop, we will sew on the straps of dense elastic, 1 inch or 2 and a half centimeters wide. Fold the lining front and back face to face and stitch the shoulder seams. Now you need to sew in the fleece collar completely. Sew two parts of the front of the pants from silk lining. Sew the received part to the front line. Sew the lining of the back of the pant. Sew the resulting part to the lining.